Hi, I'm Ray Sievert with Tracy Technologies from Houston, Texas. We're going to give you a case presentation today on the dysfunctional lens index. A surgeon presented post-RK complaining of poor vision. The concern was, should he have more corneal surgery or was it something else? His lens was not opaque, it was relatively clear. So it was not clear to the surgeons whether or not he had a lens problem. He was mapped on the eye trace and the dysfunctional lens index showed a very low score in the 3.3 range. And the opacity was also very low, indicating a clear lens. Most surgeons would not have known that his problem was now in the lens, not on the cornea. Corneal surgery wouldn't be contraindicated. However, a lens removal would be the right solution. If you have post-operative refractive corneas, you really need to use the dysfunctional lens index to understand exactly what the lens performance is. When patients complain that their LASIK has worn off or they no longer have the vision they used to get from their corneal surgery, you need to be able to demonstrate to them by use of Snell and Ease that their cornea is still capable of good vision. It's now their lens that's the problem. They've had natural aging. You can remove it and you can solve that problem. They don't need more corneal surgery. But you'll only know that when you use the Dysfunctional Lens Index.